Can we get Winter Mule? This guy just got it, so there's a chance. It is out there. What is up guys, Johnny here back with more Shadowgun Legends. In today's video, we look at the brand new update 080 and the upcoming PvP event should start today, I guess, if the iOS update is live. The Incognito event was extended. As I'm recording this video, there's still another 10 hours left. They submitted both update, but there was a problem with the iOS update. So the Android update went live and the iOS was delayed for another day. So you can see a change at Nitro. First of all, not just the colors, but the game mode. If I go left and you see the capture, the flag is live as I'm recording. And in 18 minutes, it's gonna be Ascendancy. So the team PVP modes rotate every hour. One hour of Ascendancy, one hour of capture the flag. And I'm thinking, uh, if I'm not wrong, uh, another week will be one hour of Elimination, one hour of capture the flag. They want to rotate the team PvP modes, right? But when both updates will be live, the capture the flag event will start and it's going to be only capture the flag for a full week. That's what they said on the mad stream and that should be the event. It's a capture the flag event. The rewards were already revealed yesterday. So we're going to have three hats, Double Dragon, Raiden and Panda. Guys, the Panda cap is like usually people complain about reskins but the baseball cap was rare it was only i think a pre-registration reward uh, the baseball cap so now we have a reskin cap the panda epic cap which is pretty cool but it's also kind of rare because we don't have that many caps in the game so we also got two weapons it's a shotgun again a shotgun and a machine gun uh i'll show again but you see it now on the picture uh Xinyun epic machine gun and the shotgun you see on the right also we got sticker and camel giving you a closer look the piggy sticker and the paint is called pigs can fly and you see it i think it's clouds and pigs so it's gonna be camel that you can put on your weapons that's pretty cool also last time they announced a camel it didn't happen so hopefully this time it's gonna be in the game so hopefully later today the event will go live all the team pvp modes will be replaced temporarily for capture the flag only and you're gonna be able to play it for double the fame so double fame event i don't remember ever having a double fame event since game launch 10 months ago so it's interesting that they do something new it's very cool because they added new legendaries in the game so if you get new legendary having double fame is a quick way to unlock the perks on your new weapons talking about the new legendaries we already have the location of all the new legendaries the pile driver machine gun is in blade dancer the pistol in gold arena the best ta rocket launcher is in silver arena and the winter mute smg is in voltaic fist dungeon i played quite a bit of blade and volt on my last stream i got a lot of legendaries but i just couldn't get one of the new ones so before the end of the video, we'll go and do one more Voltaic Fist, see if we can drop the SMG today. What else is new? We got a new bundle and I was super excited to buy that one. It's the Xenomorph bundle, which contained the Sulaco uh, cosmetic set. We got helmet, body and uh, Sulaco legs. We got new paint, we got two stickers and I was a bit disappointed guys. On the picture, you see the body is supposed to cover the shoulders and the gloves, right? But the actual cosmetic does not cover the shoulders. So if you wear ugly in Victor's shoulders, it's gonna show. Same thing for the gloves. I had some blue gloves when I equipped the set. You see the gloves through the cosmetic set. And the chest armor is going through also. Like maybe it was rushed. I don't know if it's a bug. Hopefully we can hear from Madfink Games soon. But still, I think it's beautiful. I love my new swag. I didn't like the hat, but it's not because the hat is not cool. The hat is cool, but my face is too ugly. So I had to change and wear a full face. But I like I like the cosmetic set. The pants are awesome. Uh, it's very nice. The belt, there's a bunch of uh, uh, pockets and stuff. It's really cool. But I'm disappointed that it doesn't cover the shoulders and the arms. I didn't play Capture the Flag yet. I will wait till the event launch and we'll play definitely play a lot of Capture the Flag this week. But yesterday on stream, I just farmed for new legendaries, trying to get something. So let's go and do one Voltaic Fist, guys. See if we can get lucky. Here we go. Match is live. I killed with randoms. And there's a big question mark. 
what if I play with randoms, but they don't have the update? Is it possible? Or can I only play with people that have the update? Because I mean, how can I get a new legendary if they cannot see it? This this is weird, right? Uh, and the, the game was very laggy. And it is at the start of every update. And people mentioned it last time on the winter event. The problem on the first couple days of an update is because people are not forced to update the game. So some people are playing on the old version, some people are playing on the new version. And I heard it's a, it's a big mess for the servers. It's uh, it requires a lot, and because of that, there's a lot of lag or freeze issues. It's not your connection; it's really the game, right? The servers. So I'm playing with randoms. Uh, this guy, beware though. I, I I know this guy. He's not a noob. I play with this guy. He's a PVP. He's a good PVP guy. So hopefully they'll wait for me. Yeah, let's go. All right, let's run. But yeah, I was very unlucky on my last stream. I think I did probably six volt and six blade or eight volt, eight blade. And I did get a lot of legendaries. I got at least four OG money maker. I got both different shoulders and blade and vault and Victor's Basilisk shoulders. I got Plasma Blaster twice. I got True Patriot once. I mean, I probably had 10 to 12 legendaries and I couldn't get one of the new legendaries. I couldn't get the machine gun or the SMG. Kush got the machine gun, Descendant I think got machine gun also. Uh, I seen people on the chat uh, reporting they got winter mute on the first attempt and Kush got his machine gun on his second attempt in Blade Dancer. So yeah, it's really RNG, it's random. You get lucky or you don't, dude. I'm gonna have to hack this. Yes. All right, room fight. We good. And one more thing about the using glitches. I don't do the the door thing on blade. Even though I did it once or twice on stream to show it was actually a thing. But I don't actually get better times when I do it, so I don't do it. But it was a big story on Facebook about, yo, Johnny should be banned because he's using the, the glitch. But I actually don't. And I don't think, I think it sucks. But I mean, I got kind of respect for people who are working. Some guys are really working all day to try to find these new glitches man uh there's a french guy on the french group he he spent a lot of time trying to find these things and then try to get the blade to the elevator and stuff uh, usually the community they don't do that much but it's interesting to find new glitches by exploiting it and doing it all day my my opinion about these glitches Honestly, is if it's not ruining the experience of other players, it's not that bad. But I understand that some guys play with randoms and especially new players, and they join they join a game and these guys they just run through the dungeon, through the doors, through the walls, and it is ruining the experience of the new player because he has no idea what's going on, and he end up alone at the start of the dungeon and both players are gone and he has no idea what to do or where to go so it's not the way the game was made to be played right but like i said to kush um we get better times when we don't do it it's confusing i don't know where to go i don't know where my buddy should go so we played all stream yesterday not using the door glitch and about the the medkit bug honestly I said in my gold arena guide and if you guys didn't get that part you have to watch the guide again I said a uh, health kit is important to stay alive at the start of round two in gold arena in the corner it's a real mess it's very hard and I use the med kit to stay alive and I said if they I hope they fix the the bug the damage bug and I would still use it not the bug but the the kit because it's important that you don't die in the corner. 
and I don't go out of my way to try to get the damage I want to stay alive and if you get the damage it's random even if you don't try sometimes it happens all right last bit he's, he's almost dead so we're gonna see if I can drop legendary because the story guys is very often I'm super unlucky on stream and then when I'm not streaming I get all the good stuff double edgy drop can it be it first attempt can we get Winter Mule? This guy just got it, so there's a chance. It is out there. Legi 1, Boots. Legi 2. Oh, shoulders. Guys, it is not the SMG. It's double drop. It's two different Legis, but it's not the one I'm looking for. So, the bad luck continues. I will keep going tomorrow or tonight if you're watching this uh, on Wednesday. I will play more on stream. Still looking for the new legendaries. Let me know in the comment, did you get any luck since the update dropped? What did you get? So once again, thank you guys for watching. Hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, leave a like. Don't forget to subscribe for more Shadowgun Legends news, gameplay, and guides. I'll be back soon. Till then, watch my other videos. Take care.